Let's do it. Okay. Um, I don't get why it's giving me one of these right when I had the ability to shop a minute ago and I didn't take it and now I'm using this, but the smell of fear. I don't really have a need to increase my devil trigger gauge. Um, or to replenish it. Uh, it would be nice to get some more vital stars, I guess, but I also don't really need... Oh, whatever. Wow, f they go up? Really? These go up? Like, I, I expected it for the blue orb, but not for that stuff. Alright. I don't even know what to do. Okay, this is really dis- Like, this camera is disorienting. Am I wrong? Am I seeing things? Or is it disorienting? I think it's disorienting. Probably supposed to go down here. Maybe. No, this is where I came from. Oh, that's where I'm supposed to be going. Am I supposed to be going back? It looks like I'm supposed to be going back. All right. Unless I'm at, I'm probably at like a different side of the building. This is a different underground tunnel. Ooh, I backflip now. All right. I feel like I saw that before too, though. And I cannot go any further than that. So, I was wrong. I'm not supposed to go back in there. I'm supposed to go this way? Maybe? Yes. Why? Ugh. Oh, this is another one of those blurry as heck, just stretched ones. Oh, this was in the uh, opening cutscene. Do I have to fight that right now? I don't understand. I still don't understand what's happening. Okay. Whoa, okay. Ouch. He does a lot of damage, I guess. But, like, he's... Not... He doesn't take hits very well. And also, like, I'm just underneath his face and I seem to be doing fine. Oh, fire? There's a lot of little birds now. The bats are really like this time. I'm really not sure if I'm doing the right thing. Also, like, this has been pretty easy so far. <laughs> oh, looks like he's actually shooting where I'm standing now, so there's not a blind spot safe zone anymore. Okay. I want to shoot Nephesturus. Neff sounds familiar. Is there like a like an actual like biblical demon named Neff or something? It doesn't have to be biblical. Like some sort of a demon named Neff. There's definitely a persona named Neff. So that's probably where I'm getting uh, the deja vu from. Where am I? One more shotgun blast, he should be good. That really seemed a lot... Oh, am I fighting another Neff now? Yeah. We 
weird floaty skull now. Ouch. Who hurts? I just gotta like, get around behind and then I can really like wail on Neff. Oh. Yeah. 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 yeah, this is um I'm saying this is an Ard, and then I looked at my health. My health is pretty low. I do have two healing items. I could use one of. Ouch. I should use one of them. Uh, the small one, though. Oh, that, that restored a lot more than I expected it to. I'll be honest there. I think I lose, like, rank points for using an item. I don't really care about rank, though. And also, the camera's pretty good for this part of the boss fight. Staying focused on Neff and like on Dante enough that I can uh, not worry. Cool, I win. That was very anticlimactic of a death. Uroboros. This isn't Resident Evil. It was almost Resident Evil 4, but that was also. The first game, not the second game. That was almost Resident Evil 4. Hey, I got a good boss clear bonus. That's nice. At least. Alright. I'll probably do one or two this session. One, one or two more in this session. Um, Because despite the game time only being an hour and three minutes, I've been recording for an hour and a half. Because I don't think it counts on this menu time. I don't have anything to power up because I'm waiting until I get 10,000 to power up my gun. My shotgun. What, an oil rig now? I guess. So I'm assuming the helicopter picked me up. Probably Lucia's helicopter. I'm, I'm just so... I'm confused. I'm very confused. Also, should I be doing a Lucia playthrough after this? I feel like I probably should. By after this, I don't mean, like, today. Also, like, even if I recorded it today, you guys wouldn't see it today. I, I'm gonna... After this session, before my next session, I'm gonna Google and see if there is any, uh... difference in the two... thing in the two campaigns. Because if, there, if there's a difference, if there's, like, a fairly significant difference. I'll do it again. I'll do another one. Or I'll, I'll do her campaign. Like, also, if there's not a significant difference, if it's basically... Like, if there's no story difference, or if there's no, like, story insight, then I will not do it again. Because I have the feeling it's just going to be the same levels again. The same missions again. Um, I don't know if I really am going to want to play both sets of missions, um, especially right after, one right after the other. Um, maybe I'll come back to the Lucia missions. I don't, I don't, I'm saying all this before I Google anything, so like, before I look anything up. Um, so I don't even know what the case is going to be with that campaign. Um, and you're welcome to comment it, but I'm probably going to have already looked it up by that by the point that you would comment it. Um, so I don't know, but... 
I'd like just like to know what's going on. Like from a story perspective. Oh, more! Did they just respawn because I walked back, or was I not done? I'm not sure which it was. Also, it's probably bad that I keep reading the Hama, Hama, Hamram Siras as uh, Hiroshima's. Just because I can't read, it seems. Killing, mindlessly killing people again, or little things, monsters, demons. I don't really have anything to say about mindlessly killing demons. I also don't really want to jump up there just in case these are just respawning. Um, I want to like accidentally make them respawn again. I might be doing that, so... I don't think they're actually gone this time. Ooh. Can't get up too much. It's that garage. There's a thing over here. Probably go up where this ladder is. Can I climb the ladder? Nope. Yeah, no. Who needs ladder climbs and you can... Jump like a Dante. Like a demon hunter, like a son of Sparta, like a. Oh my god! They are just respawning. And I'm still killing them because I'm greedy. I want all the orbs. I didn't even really drop very significant orbs, but. I want them regardless. I'm sure this is super entertaining to watch me fight the same group of enemies for the third time in a row. That's how blind LPs go on this channel. I cut nothing out. This is like an interruption. So I'm gonna make him respond for walking that far away. No! I did. Okay, I'm done. I'm not fighting them again. I just want to get on the pipe. Can I do that? Can I get on the pipe and go the right way? Please. Can I just do that? Can you just help me do that game? Am I not noticing? I think I can probably just walk on. Oh my god, there's another camera angle that just wasn't showing. Because I wasn't. Oh, and now I'm sliding down the pipe. Okay. Whatever works. Am I supposed to be going that way? Maybe. Because yeah, it's just a garage I can't get into.
Okay, whatever. Let's just move. I need to sit here and kill every little thing. He says before trying to sit here and kill every little thing. Ooh, gold orb. Need that. Also, I don't like how I can only carry one gold orb, because I had definitely picked up a second one when I had my first one that I used. That I have since used. And into the door! Oh, it's one of these. So that's a thing I'm going to get. It's probably another amulet for uh, my demon form. What is that? It cannot... Oh, it blows up. It's like a mine, basically. When it opens up like that, I can shoot. Do I just have to keep going down, I guess? Oh shoot, I'm right next to one of those low yuppers. Cool. Yeah. I don't know how to do that. I'm just gonna leave it be. This is a magic roof filler, right? Oh, I've got to fly, don't I? this thing which is another amulet from the looks of it and what can I do now fierce flame demon ooh Oh, so it's fire now. Okay. What does that do for me? Glad I decided to try that door. I feel like the flame will do nothing against these enemies. enemies or what? You know, the pistols for good that. Well, I would think I could hit multiple of them at once with these guys, with the shotgun. Dante, can you use the pistol, the second pistol that you're holding to, like, actually shoot something? You know what, what I can do right now? Beef up my shotgun. And now wait till I can beef anything else up. Oh, 
probably ouch get to this door <coughs> Ooh, is that a, a new sword vendetta a decorative sword that is like death scythe thick huge sword with a short range let me see Oop. That's not the right button. I don't know. I'll use it for now, and we'll see. We'll see what comes of it, and if I like Rebellion better, then I will switch back to Rebellion. I wasn't trying to walk there. It's just my controller being dumb again. I don't know how bad this range trade-off is going to be. Oh, but now I know I, I do know that I'm going to be fighting enemies on this thing. And although there, it does seem like a very short range, oh. it's a, just these guys. Give me my pistols back for a minute. Really quick kills on these things. I wish the D pad would let me switch weapons. But alas. <clears throat> it doesn't. I just jumped down. Nope. I guess it was expecting me to fight them longer and not switch to the pistols um oh I just wanted to show me that there's blood goats coming Maybe that they're coming up here are they gonna come up here I can't tell a significant range or like damage uh difference actually damage seems a lot better Ouch. Although, I don't know why the camera's not following. Oh yeah, damage is much better. Holy wow. I think I like Vendetta. That, that's what this is called, right? Vendetta. It doesn't even seem to be that short range. I cannot tell a significant range difference. And also... But if there is a if there is a significant range difference, then I am going all short range in this playthrough, in this uh, let's play, in this blind run. I don't know what the beeping. Oh, because it's a train. It's like a train car. More or less. It's the equivalent of a train car. Also, did they change the name of those skeleton dudes we've been fighting? Or are those different skeleton dudes? I want to break those boxes. Can I break those boxes, please? Something stand by those boxes. There we go. How close are we? Two arrows of... It looked like two arrows of four. They give me this close range sword and then put me in all these close range uh, areas. Also, this sword doesn't look or feel very close range. Like, more than Rebellion, anyway. So, whatever. I ain't complaining. One more arrow. We're in the last arrow. Did you kill everything too quick? I guess. Or can I... Cannot walk out yet. I think I just killed everything too quick. Are we there yet? Uh, ooh, cannot be able to moving. I was trying to backflip off the door. 
Sounds like we're good. What's over here? No, absolutely nothing. No, absolutely nothing, I just said. Cannot break this box. Could break the other ones, though. Oh! Hey, look, more enemies that we're going to be fighting on this thing. Probably. It's a good assumption. I hear enemies. Oh. Let me, uh... Swap back. And stand here so I can pick up all the red orbs. Oh, there's one more. A couple more. Cool. I think I'm safe to swap back now. I wish it was like a hot swap. Like I said, I wish the D-pad had something to do. It doesn't. So far, anyway. We might give it something to do later. But I kind of doubt it. Or maybe uh, Lucia has the D-pad do something if you play as Lucia. Who is this guy? Getting into the plane helicopter that we were in. I don't know why I said plane. I knew it wasn't a plane. What the? Uh, what is happening? Really? What is happening? I can do one more, one more mission this, this, uh, session. All right, let's do it. Hopefully it's not a long one. I could ask you the same question. Do you have to ask. Hmm. Maybe another time. Yeeks. Is this whole mission just going to be a boss? Maybe. Also, that's not the sword I have equipped. Oh, that was painful. It was also painful. Also, I'm pretty sure I'm going to change my amulet real quick. They gave me a fire amulet. Uh, when likely fire's gonna do nothing against this guy. Ooh, okay. So dodging him, gotta dodge the hammer too. I already don't like this pulse. It's kinda kicking the butt. All right, let me get some help in this corner. Is that a long range attack? Yeah. Can I hit him from behind now that he's facing? I got a hit off on him. So that's something. I want to move to get these red orbs. There's inexplicably red orbs over here. I'm trying to jump him when he charges, but it's not working very well. And I already want that other health, and I can't... Am I dead? Am I stuck? The other red orbs over here, too. 
And then there's more red orbs on that side. This whole stage might be a boss fight. I can like machine gun. Am I invincible in this mode? Looks like I am. Well, I won. I feel like using Devil Trigger or whatever that mode is called is a little cheap, but I did it. It's part of the game. It's not the sword I have equipped. That was that whole mission. Okay. Well. I said this would be my last mission for this session. So I guess it will be. Um, and I guess I will be doing, uh, like, two mission... Uh, oh, no. It's not where I wanted to save it. But my controller freaked out. Um, I guess I will be doing, like, two mission uh, combinations for next time. Or for, for some parts. But yeah, I don't know. We'll see when I edit things. But yeah. That's it. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I'll see you guys in the next part. Have a good day. Slash night. Whenever you're watching this.